Founded in 1774, Peniter is one of the oldest names in the stationery business. Throughout their history, the Florentine manufacturer counts government officials, foreign dignitaries, writers, and poets as customers of their brand. Around 1884, Peniter began manufacturing fountain pens and leather goods shortly thereafter. In 2017, they hired Dante Del Vecchio, the former Visconti co-owner and pen designer extraordinaire, to lead their brand into the 21st century with innovative, high-end luxury writing instruments. In this video, we're taking a look at Peniter's latest pen design, the Avatar Ultra Resin Collection. Like the virtual world, Avatar stands for the alter ego. This Italian pen collection from Peniter aims to be the writer's extension of themselves. The 2019 Avatar Ultra Resin is the next evolution in pen design available in six intense resins with palladium plated accents. What exactly is Ultra Resin? We'll explain in further detail as we discuss the other points of this writing instrument. The marine steel clip is an interpretation of the goose quill and has a sturdy spring-loaded mechanism to allow you to clip it securely to pockets, notebooks, papers, and the like. The pen's engraved center band ring is inspired by the skyline of Florence, Italy. On the Avatar UR fountain pen, Peniter fitted a stainless steel number 6 size Bach nib with Art Deco engraving. Available in finer medium point sizes, the pen includes an international size converter, but no ink cartridge in the packaging. Matching twist action ballpoint and magnetically capped rollerball complete the three writing modes in this series. Let's compare the Peniter Avatar Ultra Resin Fountain Pen with the previous Avatar, as well as the Visconti Rembrandt Visconti Breeze and the Leonardo Officina Furore. Dante Del Vecchio is a pioneer in designing pens with materials that push the envelope. Back when he worked for Visconti, he crafted the paragon of grail pens, the Homo sapiens, based on the idea of a pen made from basaltic lava. He's done it again with the Peniter's Ultra Resin. Developed in Florence, Italy, Ultra Resin is said to be extremely rigid, incredibly resistant to damage, and, quote, as close to unbreakable that modern technology allows. Well, Signore Del Vecchio, when you claim the pen is virtually unbreakable, I cannot help myself from trying. The following torture tests were performed in a controlled environment under the supervision of trained professionals. Cold Spot Pens must insist that no one attempt to recreate or reenact any of these tests as they may injure themselves or, more importantly, your pen. Please do not try this at home. If you do intentionally break a Peniter avatar and try to return it to Gold Spot Pens or Yaffa Pen Company, we will laugh at you and hang up on you.
Our torture test proved that the ultra resin of the Peniter avatar, UR, withstood drops and falls that a pen might incur during everyday usage. Even when running it over with a car, the pen only received slight dings from impressions left of the gravel that pressed into the surface at such high pressures. Only when faced with the brutal severity of a bear trap and gunfire did the pen finally shatter. So now we know that, despite being an injection molded resin, the Avatar UR is a sturdy pen that can take its fair share of lumps. But let's not overlook the most important part, the writing experience. On the fountain pen, the box steel nib performs admirably right out of the box. It's bouncy for a steel nib, providing some line variation when pressed. The flow is a bit on the drier side and even for a medium, has some noticeable feedback. The polished metal grip section may be a concern for some, so I'll explain the details and you can determine if this would be a good fit for you. The section tapers to a small waist that measures 8 millimeters in diameter, then flares out to prevent your fingers from sliding all the way down to the nib and feed. While the flare at the end keeps your fingers from sliding down, the pinched in part of the section feels thin. The cap can be posted on the back but feels a bit back weighted when doing so. Also, the engraved cap band edge might feel uncomfortable for larger hands. The rollerball utilizes an international standard rollerball refill cartridge that writes smoothly with a consistent wet line. The twist action ballpoint mode has a Parker style Easy Flow 9000 cartridge installed that feels smooth on paper. So, did it break your heart to see the Peniter avatar demolished? Or are you oddly satisfied to see a pen pushed to its breaking point? In any case, you can save an Avatar UR from our destructive hands by purchasing one at Gold Spot Pens today. If you enjoyed watching this video review and torture test, subscribe now so you don't miss any of our new content on the channel. Thanks for watching, and as always, stay inky, my friends. Take care.